guys a new update just came out iOS 9.0.1 okay so if you're updating so let's just go into settings now this is for iPad I and I put touch same thing for iPhone whichever you have you have to go into your settings from their general from their software update now uh, remember if you guys want to ever jailbreak your phone iPad or iPod touch don't update it this way connect it to your computer um, hook it up to iTunes and from iTunes on your computer update it from there okay just uh, in case and also if you guys don't see this for some reason again just do it for your computer and it's gonna be just as easy um, if you're updating from iOS 9 to this 9.0.1 then there's no really need to make uh, extra backup however if you guys are in iOS 8 and you're just doing this update in that case yes make a backup on your iCloud and make a backup on your iTunes okay remember iTunes on your computer there's no limit of how many gigs so you can just do a really nice big backup um, and as you know iCloud there's a 5 gig limit um, or else you have to pay money so um, doing it on your computer is just easier and cheaper right because it's free on your computer um, anyways um, to download this and install just click on download and install and you guys will see that it's gonna take no time at all maximum 15 minutes you won't need to put your Apple ID again all that um, if you're updating from iOS 8 to this then it might ask you for your Apple ID again, it might, okay? Um, for iPads, it usually doesn't. For iPhones, sometimes it does, okay? Um, however, you can always skip those things if you guys uh, don't know your password for some reason. You can always skip that stuff, okay? Um, anyways, that's it for this tutorial. All you guys have to do is click on Agree, Agree, it's gonna download it, then install. Make sure to have some battery, okay? I would suggest having it hooked up to some electricity. If your phone dies in the process of this installation, then you guys will have problems, okay? And you guys will have to connect it to your computer and restore your phone because there was a mistake. Uh, again, if you're stuck for some reason, you're gonna have to hook it up to your computer and restore it and that's the main reason why I'm telling you to make an, a backup however again if you're in iOS 9 and then just updating to this uh, don't worry don't worry about the backup it's not a big deal if you're doing it from iOS 8 to 9 again do it and that's it anyways that's it for this tutorial if you guys have any questions comments you can write them down here below in the comments area and don't forget to subscribe and rate thank you